Welcome everyone, Codename Soap here, coming at you today with a brand new series. Yes! Actually, I'm going to be doing two new series. Ooh, adventure! I'm going to be doing two games, a little different from the usual. One is Inside, and I've been excited to play this for a little bit. I've heard a lot of great things about it, plus it's kind of the follow-up to Limbo, which I love. Limbo, it's such a good game, and I'm very, very excited to see what's inside. Inside. Ah, hilarity. So yes, we ended Enderall, for those of you who are kind of coming into this, wanting a recap of what's going on. Ended in a roll, uh, was not having a lot of fun with it, so I decided to do that. And I've decided to replace Enderall with two other games, and specifically two indie games. I'm not going to say here what the other one is, but there will be another one that I'm going to record immediately after I get done recording this. So two new games, with so there will be a total of four videos every week, and... There we go. So, before we, we get started with this brand new series on this game, as always, thank you for watching. Hope you enjoy. Alright, so kind of similar to Limbo already, and that you just kind of start, no story. I'm going to assume there's no dialogue. Controls seem to be so, per so far pretty straightforward. I'm using a wired, or and it's, it's an Xbox One controller, but it's plugged in right now. Left stick is going to move you back and forth. Your A button is going to jump. I'm sure your X or your B is going to be like interact, but so far all the other controls seem to not be doing anything. Well, let's check our settings. There's a brightness, a resolution. That's the native, 19, 1920 with 1080, full screen on, of course, brightness. Um... We'll bump it up a skosh, because I know on YouTube it's going to be a little bit uh, darker, so we'll do that. And we'll go back. Controller. There we go. I knew it was going to be X. <laughs> I'm going to turn that vibration off. I don't like vibration on my controllers. But yeah, there it is. Simple, just two buttons and a stick. That volume max. Okay. All right, let's resume. Pretty straightforward. Pretty straightforward. But, uh Already sim similar to Limbo, I love the art style. So yeah, a mysterious boy dropped into a mysterious land. And essentially we're going to try to navigate our way through. Watch out. Very atmospheric. I love it. Barbed wire. Let's look out. Oh, he's just gonna... Oh, he just goes right through. That's cool. That's... Interesting. It was like a... This truck had a bunch of people in it. And get on the sneaky stink mode right away. Very interesting. See some people walking in the background. Like some... Maybe... Pods or generators behind all of it. It's the thing I like about at least Limbo is you kind of have to make your own story. It doesn't really tell it for you. No dialogue whatsoever. So for some people, I can understand why, hey, I want to watch this and I don't want anyone else talking over it. I can understand that. Since there's not really much dialogue here. Oh, and they're wearing masks, too. Where are you going? Very interesting. And that pod's got, like, a little light inside of it. Giant pipe going up to it. Hmm. Intrigue abound, dear readers. Let's just keep going. Little refrigerator. Knock that over. Hooch. There goes this, the truck with some people and whatnot. There's a 
be very, very quiet. I have a feeling that box is gonna make some noise. No. All right, good. Get on for the ride? No ride. <laughs> yeah, this is very, very similar to Limbo in the way of you'll have like different objects that you're gonna need to interact with to proceed through the environment. Traditional kind of, not, well, not very traditional platformer style. We may, we've been spotted. We've been spotted. Run! It's close. Now there's someone in a van. Okay, they're after us. With the dogs. Okay, let's just keep going. Trying to keep a look out onto the ground because the limbo was kind of notorious for having various traps on the ground that you couldn't really see. Of course, also a big spider that was kind of coming after you. That, that was a thing. <laughs> There's something coming up. Yep, right there. Ooh, let's just keep running, just keep running. And noticed right away that that seemed to be like a, a cave you could hide behind. A little, little, little cave kind of situation. A little mini cave. But let's keep going. I just wonder about what is going on in this world. Okay, <laughs> these guys in masks mean business. I got shot. Ugh, that's that's even more brutal than getting killed in limbo. <laughs> Jeez, just a little, just a little kid. All right, let's jump over that log. I think we have to do something with the RV right here, maybe. Did they get us? Oh, it's like a trank dart in our back. Damn. All right, let's just kind of hang out here for a second and see if they if they go away. Doesn't look like they are. All right, let's just swim. Starting to choke a little. All right. Just keep going, kid. Let's go. Keep going. Dead pigs. Interesting. All right. It looks like we're. 
We're out on the road. And off. Okay, yes, heading to the cornfields. Nothing bad has ever happened in a cornfield. Love the way this game looks. Love it. Just zoom ahead. I don't know. It's like little... Little chickens, little chirp chirps, little birdies. Okay, definitely on the farm. More, more pigs, little chicks. It's interesting, they're like, coming to us. Maybe they're, they're hungry? And that's why they're coming? Just a little swing. Hit her head. <laughs> that's all right. All right. Old generator. See what's back this way. Come on, chickens. <laughs> Alright. You guys are gonna help me out. Possibly. So I think we need to knock that hay haystack off. Oh, that looks like it's trying to do a vacuum situation. Chickens, I think you have to go in there. to follow me. Alright, so what what's our environment telling us? I'm assuming it's to get those chickens. Just can't tell if it's Put, like the air is pushing it over there. Hmm. But I think I have to slaughter the chicks. Unless there's something around here that I just am not seeing, but doesn't appear to be the case. And they didn't die! Well, at least some of them. Looks like this one did. It was like a little chick machine gun. <laughs> Alright. Let's proceed forward. We're gonna have to jump on some dead pigs, aren't we? Hooch! Of course, before we proceed... F ah, that's interactive, okay. And up. 
Okay. Worms? Or big earth earthworms, maybe? Hopefully not some, like... Oh, they're st stuck in the... Livestock, so that's probably not just a regular worm. <laughs> okay, we can climb the fence. That's always good. And of course, got the mud. They're like giant maggots or something. He's coming out of his butt. Ooh. seeing if there's any extra places we could go with those guys. Alright, check back, of course. Doesn't seem to be anything. Proceed onward. That just took a very interesting turn. Starting to see a little bit of sun. That's great. Great. Just keep going. Ah, oh, more potential zombie guys near the back of a truck. Similar to what we saw previously. Hmm. Very interesting. So got a chain there, probably gonna need to do a little bit of this. Okay. This 
So already, it is, at least to me, more intriguing than Limbo. I love Limbo, but this has more intrigue abound. Let's just swing, see if we can get any more distance on it. There we go. Here are more chicks. Does that chair do anything? No, no. More chicks. Hello, chicks. Nope, regular birds, okay. Gonna have to pull that down, I bet. Which means we're gonna have to get up there, push it down. Chirp, 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 chirp. <laughs> Maybe they're chicks, who knows? Doesn't make a difference. Doesn't matter. Let's just keep going. Yeah, definitely up there. Gonna have to do a few things. Yeah, so let's come on over. Okay. Okay. Let's see what this does first. For platforming purposes. I'm trying to think. That. Yeah, that's gotta be jumpable. center it. But this could be the interesting part of if that's even jumpable. Because that is a long, long jump. But it's worth a shot. Oh. Yeah. Okay. So we do have to bring it back down. Yeah, I'm pretty sure we had it right the first time now that I'm seeing this. <clears throat> and let's come back jump over this jump on the ladder climb the ladder turn around jumping okay jumping should grab that come on now get it together all right turn jump jump grab jump grab there we go Now we're pushing the safe off. Ah, oh, it's probably gonna break down there. <laughs> I knew I knew that was coming, and that was not gonna be pretty if we missed that. But that's the nice thing with these games is you can kind of you're not in a rush to do all your platforming. You can just kind of survey the situation. But I do want to check this out. What's all this then? Hello? Got an achievement. Left behind. Just pulled the power off of something, but what is the question? What did we just do? <laughs> Maybe it's for the train? Got that open. This reminds me so much of uh, the game uh, The Swapper, where you're kind of controlling different clones and stuff. Okay, so I see it makes... So I'm assuming we've got to get both of them. So do that, so they don't have the extra distance. And then bring them back together. 
There we go. Yeah, very similar to the Swapper, actually. There, there's some puzzles that are just like that. Swapper is a great game. All right, let's climb it up a bit. Start coming down this little roof of this warehouse situation. Jump it up. Ooh, what's going on down there? Hmm. It'd be cool if this was the same like rooftops and warehouses as uh, near the end of Limbo. That'd be pretty cool. And, ooh, made it. Okay. Close one. Hooch. Cross the beam. Ooh, that's not good. <laughs> that basically <laughs> was an unexpected event of s potential circumstances and consequences. Potential things could be coming. There we go. All right. Got a ladder. Doesn't seem to go much somewhere, but I wonder if this is going to be a we have to move the ladder kind of situation. There we go. may have been a bad idea, but it also may have been necessary to what we're doing. Let's see if I can turn it off. Okay. Let's proceed forward without those things scanning. So we do need the power. Whew. This will be an interesting... Because part of me thinks they're going to have just, like, guns or that these things are going to come to life and try to kill us. <laughs> or that'll happen. I thought we were going to be much further back. Okay. Fair enough. Atmospheric, enough intensity, a little bit of thinking so far, telling a story without any words. Gorgeous, gorgeous. Alright, bird. What are you gonna cause here? Okay. Didn't know if he was gonna alert the uh, Gestapo below us. Ooh. Hold on, buddy. Oh! Kid. <laughs> of 
we are being watched. Something is not right here. We're here. timing it's kind of musical which is making it very interesting. Run? Yeah, I'm running. 